One more person we want to remember here. He was a man who devoted much of his life to two things, music and San Diego. And generations of students and musicians, young and old, came to know him and respect him. He was such a gentle and yet passionate man who totally and completely loved making music beyond his 100th birthday. He was just a few weeks shy of 101 years old, Eugene de Bach Vacher, who devoted his life to San Diego and to making music here, and he wanted to do it just as long as he could. As long as I could physically hold a stick, even if I had to sit down and hold a stick. At public performances and rehearsals, he was like a kid half his age, tireless conductor of two of San Diego's most under-publicized musical groups, the City Guard Band, which goes back to the days of the Civil War, and the San Diego Mandolin Orchestra, all mandolins. And there was Eugene Vacher every week for years, stick in hand, an absolute product of San Diego, born in 1909, raised in El Cajon on a citrus ranch, except for the war, never left. No, I went to college and I went through school in El Cajon, Grossmont, San Diego State. He was, in fact, the oldest member of San Diego State's Alumni Association, and he was living proof that doing what you love keeps you going. Oh, I wouldn't do anything else. Toward the end, he was still composing music, still giving the gift of it to his community, still loving it. I expect to uh, die with the stick in my hand. Eugene Vacher will be missed for all his life. He was something special about San Diego. He played in San Diego concert and dance bands and played in what was then called the San Diego Civic Symphony. And he was essentially self-taught. At the age of 10, he ordered a coronet through the mail, and he also mail-ordered the instruction as to how to play it. But you consider how many countless, really countless performances of the City Guard Band in Old Town and elsewhere, and the mandolin band performances, all of them, all the students he taught, and the number of people who were touched by Eugene Vacher and his music, he had a remarkable life.